Hey guys, what's up? Cubic Race here. This is the third part of the Frederick Method tutorial. The first part was about F2L and the second part was about OLL. You can access those tutorials by clicking on these links. This is the third part uh, about PLL. Now PLL stands for permutation of the last layer. Uh, now PLL as an OLL is of two types. Full PLL and two look PLL. In the full PLL, after doing the OLL, you look at a case, do an algorithm, and the cube will be solved. While in two-loop PLL, uh, after OLL, you look at a case, do an algorithm, look at another case, and then do another algorithm, and then the cube will be solved. So, the full PLL is definitely faster than the two-loop PLL, but two-loop PLL only has six algorithms to memorize, while the full PLL has 21 algorithms to memorize. I initially used uh, the two look PLL while uh, starting the Frederick method but I have now shifted to the full PLL of 21 algorithms. Now let's get started with the tutorial. Okay, so I'll divide the PLL tutorial into two parts or two types. The first type will be after OLL when you have a headlight in one of the sites and the second type will be when you won't have any headlights. Now the first type contains many cases but the second type contains only one cases. So let's start off with the type 1 when you do have a headlight. Okay, so let's check whether we have headlights or not. So no headlights, no headlights, no headlights. We have a pair of headlights here. Headlights are only uh, similar colors on the two corners at a side. So we have headlights here. Now whenever after OLL you have a headlight, that is whenever you encounter, encounter type 1 of the PLL, keep the headlights at the back side of the cube and then do the following algorithm. X R prime U R prime D2 R U prime R prime D2 R2 then do an X prime. Then you'll run into a case and I'll keep the cases now okay so this is type 1 case 1 so first of all let's line the corners up or the headlights up with the respective respective colors now we can easily see that this edge that is yellow orange needs to go to the orange side yellow orange and yellow green edge needs to go to the green side and the same is with the opposite two sides yellow red has to go here yellow blue has to go here so First of all, we have to keep the cube so that the edges that are to be swapped are here, just like this. And if we keep it like this also, then it's also okay. Then you have to do the following algorithm. M2 U, M2 U, M prime U2, M2 U2, M prime U2. And the PLL will be done. The second case looks somewhat similar to the first case, but it's not similar not the same so here this edge needs to go to the opposite side this edge needs to come here and this edge needs to go here this edge needs to go here so it basically forms a plus sign so you can keep the cube at any angle here and do the following algorithm m2 u m2 u2 m2 u m2 a fairly easy algorithm to learn okay so Another case you can encounter is that one side is completely solved and whenever one side is completely solved, keep it at the back. Now, you can see that this edge needs to go here, red, this orange edge needs to go here and this blue edge needs to come here. So they have to be cycled in a counterclockwise direction. So the algorithm to do this is R U prime R U R U R u prime r prime u prime r2 and that will solve it okay so the next case looks somewhat similar to the first case but is different here also one side is solved and you keep the solved side at the back then here the edges have to be cycled clockwise so the orange goes here the yellow red goes here and the blue comes here so it forms a clockwise cycle you do the following algorithm r2 u r u r prime u prime r prime u prime r prime u r prime and the cube will be solved 
Now we are over with type 1. Type 2, we do not have any headlights on any side. So as you can see here, we do not have any headlights. So here you have to do one algorithm that is x r u prime r prime d r u r prime small u2 r prime u r d r prime u r now you'll encounter one of the cases of the type 1 that i taught you and you can just apply the respective algorithm and the cube will be solved so here it's the case 1 and the cube is solved. Now, the PLL tutorial is over. over. Of course, after doing OLL, if you find the top layer already solved, it's good luck for you. The full uh, PLL tutorial will be out soon, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.